guys, I'm back and today I'm doing another video on Idiot Box because it's had a few updates since my last video. So to start off, come to the Idiot Box website, I'll have the link in the description, go to download, and click the download button. It'll take you to the, the Mediafire page, just click download. Once that's all done, open it up, just drag idiotbox.lua and the bin folder to your desktop you can read this if you want but you don't have to once you've done that go to where your garage wallet is installed for me I have it on Steam so it's installed in where my Steam games are go to Gary's mod Gary's mod Lua put idiot box inside there if it asks you to replace just click replace and the exact same with bin Ask you click replace, click replace. And now you're done. Idiot box is installed. I'll now show you what to do in game. Alright, once you've uh, loaded up in game, just press the console button and type uh, sv underscore allow. Oh. Client side lure 1. I'll, uh, I'll have that command in the description, don't worry. And then lure underscore open script underscore cl. Idiotbox.lure. Once you've entered that in, we'll come up with all this. Then to open Idiot Box, just press insert, and now you have Idiot Box. So this is version 6.2.1. So we've got Aimbot, Triggerbot, Wallhack, More, and Settings. So this just allows you, I'll go over the settings first. It just allows you to change the colour and distance of Wallhack for everything. So I'm going to make the menu harder. Let's make it, I'm going to make it blue actually. Actually, I'm not a fan of blue. Yeah, let's make it sign. I'm a f uh, uh, I like that a bit better. Right. Aimbot. Um, turn this off a sec. I'll go through it. Uh, obviously, you want it enabled. Uh, aim on key. Just select the key to aim on. So, if I spawn a bot here, because it won't target NPCs. And uh, I, I get out. I don't know. Fuck it. We'll get out. Uh, Ray gun. As you see, it now snaps to him no matter where I'm looking. But I'm not a fan of the snapping because it's kind of obvious. So I'm, I, I like to put on silent. You can change this to which, whichever you prefer, but I like it as mouse three. Uh, silent means it, it, although it's not snapping, it is still aiming. And also, I should recommend having auto fire on because that way, when you press the button, it, it just shoots. And that, that that that's all good. Hold on. That's way too loud. Yeah, I'm happy with that. Moving on, so there's a bot. Uh, target lock it, it allows you to not. So if you have multiple targets, it's not gonna like just shoot once and snap between them. It'll make sure it kills them before it moves to the next one. So I just come over here. I should not. I thought I'm gonna not gonna use the regular because it's just not. It's not. It's demonstrating this well. There we go. That demonstrates that aimbot much a lot better. Um. The aim priorities, I'm not going to bother messing with this, but it's just, it just, as it says, it just changes the way you aim. So if I take body aim, as you see, it's not going to shoot me in the head, which is, it, it, it's better to have that on if you're trying to look legit. I recommend always having this on, there you this red snap lines bullet time, or, or it will, they're just all good things to turn on. I mean, they're all fairly self-explanatory. Snap lines is, is the line that you're seeing where it's always recommend having that on because it, it shows which enemy you're going to snap to. Move on trigger bot, I like trigger bot, it just, as it says, every time your crosshair looks at someone's going to shoot, which is especially good for, if I pull out an op here, if you're trying to, if you, I don't know, doing quick scope, no scopes in Gary's mod, because everyone does that, and you can just, you know, easily beat your friend at that, easily beat your friend at some quick scope, no scopes, oh, I forgot what you got, yeah. If it's not a semi-automatic weapon, it's just gonna, yeah, gonna straight up shoot. Yeah, good stuff, good stuff all around. There we go. I like using these weapons. If I'm gonna use this Thompson, actually. Uh, I'm gonna turn off trigger, but you also have all the uh, ignore things. Full hack, I've got box on but I'm not a fan of box. I like to I like to use uh, charms, transparent charms. 
and uh, you can uh, you can change all this. So if you like rank, money, weapon, armor value, you can have all that on. But I don't like having too much of that on because it just, especially if there's a lot of players in the server, it just creates a lot of mess. I just like having uh, the health bar. Sometimes I'll, I might, I don't know if I'm going to turn that off actually. If I'm going to turn off transparent charms and just have charms on, I believe you can edit the color of the charms. I'm sure you can. Yeah, here we go. Enemy charms. Although they, I don't know if they count as enemies. I think they count. Yeah, they count as team. Yeah, because I'm not in dark RP or en or anything that uses teams. So I'm them to blue. But yeah, there you go. Uh, moving on from true. Oh, we're back to wall hacks. You have everything you can, you know, mess with everything here. Here looks quite cool. Oh, that's quite cool. If you turn off charms, that will make it where they are just they're the they're their normal cells, but you know, stable through walls. That, that that's quite cool. As you see, the aimbot is uh quite good. I I would say quite good. Uh, I'm gonna turn off. I'm gonna start having charms on. Uh, then you got chat spam. This is cool. If you just want to spam, haven't they? You can change the spam as well, but I mean it's not gonna work. Uh, oh, clear chat's good. So the, I I love using this in servers because people always are like, oh, what the fuck's going on? No one will be able to like the chat. And they, they, the moment anyone sends anything, it see it it, it just gets cleared instantly. That's a good one. Name stealer, I, it's just gonna, yeah, um, yeah. Normal name, you know, names, name stealers. You see, I've now bought three. Mirror, this is great as well. You can, allows you to see see behind you, so you know. Don't have mirror emotes. This is cool. Just allows you to uh, do emotes whenever, but I don't know. On servers that don't allow emotes, that's gonna look fishy. Bunny hop or not, stray followers have these on because it just, you know, who, who doesn't like bunny hopping? Much faster than sprinting and gets you, only if, like, people are gonna, like, if you're doing it, if you're bunny hopping perfectly, oh yeah, and there's third person. If you're bunny hopping perfectly, people are gonna know something's up, so I suggest not doing it around admins. Moving on. Spectators, radar, team colours, you know, you got traitor finder and murder finder there, they're good. Oh this is this is weird. This just allows you to have everything transparent. If that's what you want. But yeah, all good stuff, all good stuff. Moving on to more uh, wireframe, no hands, I, I always like messing with that. I like to make a lot of wireframe pure red. White the fact that white is quite nice actually. But I'm usually I usually just like doing no hands. Auto response. Uh, I'm assuming the way that just works at the moment, someone types I think they're just gonna say sharp. I've never tried it. I, I don't know how it works, but yeah. Oh, and you also have uh, the chains log every time. So if you only want to now, you can just read all here. But yeah, uh, FOV. Now I already have my FOV like already set in the Gmod settings to high. So like if I change it to 90, it's gonna be lower. But you can just you know really increase it up if you feel like. But no, if I give myself hands back, it is it is very fun increasing it up, so you get an incredible amount of FOV, and just seeing how crazy your weapons look, especially the fist gun. The fist gun's always fun, and like where you have like incredibly long reached arms. And I wonder what like some of the there you go, what were the Mustang and Sally's like? You have some incredible long hands. Don't worry, that's not the only shit. That's just. The wonder weapons being shit. I wonder how well the scavenger would work. It's still a sniper rifle, technically. I don't know how well it's now. Nah, I don't think it would work that well with, with uh, an explosive weapon. But if I pull out a sniper, as you see, there they all go. Um, oh, you can, yeah, I've already said kill spam. I'm assuming that is just when I get a kill. Yeah, it, it's gonna, yeah, sh talk shit about them. I thought so. Uh, hide HUD. Ah, oh, that's cool. I suppose if if you if you're recording some sort of cinematic, that could be cool. Flashlight spam, so, uh, rapid fire, yeah, full bright. It actually makes it kind of darker. Well, no, it just removes all shadows on it. It's kind of weird. No sky, it just makes the sky black. Full bright. There you go. Uh, rapid fire is good for servers that use like ri like the original CS weapons, like the five seven or the P two two P two two eight, and it actually just absolutely spam them. Yeah. 
Um, chat death notifying chat message. I. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, okay. It just tells me who I killed. That's that's cool. So if I turn off chat notify. Where's the death message going? Yeah. Uh, or reload that. That's uh, if we set it to like. Okay. Too high. I'm guessing it's going to all reload me at six bullets. Oh, four. Okay. Cool. Uh, moving on. Anything else here? Nope. No, I'm pretty happy for anything else. Oh, I haven't gone through. Uh, if you. What's it? So I'm going to save this as legit, but I haven't gone through Rage Bot. So the way I do this, I'd set that to none so you automatically shoot. Uh, I'd leave that as it is. Enable that. I'm going to quickly throw on. Third person, you can see what's what's going to go on. So if I do a spin bot, and then I do down, you can turn up the speed. But as you see, you've got you know your your average. Uh, and the aim here, if you're doing I don't know hack rehack or whatever. But yeah. That's that's probably my. F I'm gonna I'm gonna save that as rage bot. Obviously, if you no clip, it's not gonna come up, and if you run, it also will tr stop the anti aim. But if you stand still, it's gonna be all good. I'm gonna look up the scout here. Let me turn off third person because this is just horrible to look at. As you can shit on everyone with this. It is very fun to sh sh absolutely shit on people. They can't even get out of spawn. I'm gonna add more bots actually. Oh, I've only added four slots. But yeah, it's, it is fun to just snipe the hell out of people. Uh, now, to use this, to use this on a server, uh, you're, gonna, you're gonna need a bypass. I'll quickly show that now. Now, important. This is not a CAC bypass. I will. I will eventually get round. If I'm gonna, okay, let me just turn all this off. I will eventually get round to showcasing a, a bypass that does bypass K candy cheat. So I mean, if you get banned by servers, oh well, shit. They are. They are. They are anti cheat. But some servers don't. So just hope you find a server that doesn't have anti cheat. All this bypasses is you not being able to load. Uh, load cheats. So I'll just in the description, you just want to type Lua underscore open script CL and then it is dark. I mean it's it's called dark if you want bypasser, but it, it works on any game mode. But yeah, once you've done that you can just disconnect. And now once I've found a server, I'll resume the recording. As you see I've uh, I've loaded into the server here. I'm gonna find like a nice little spot to load the hack because I'm already getting shot at. Right here we are. You can enter it in. Now let's load it up. Load legit bot. Gonna grab some sort of weapon. I don't know, I'll grab. Hey, sure. Oh, this server's laggy. In fact, I'm gonna see. Can I no clip? Am I allowed to no? Nope, nope, no no clip. Okay. Ah, there we go. We've got, we've got a nice kill there. As you see, I can just go around sniping the fuck out of people. But but yeah, that's it for me, guys. I'm out. No, oh, oh, Wolf's asking for a team. Sure, mate. Hold on, let's let's let's, let's team up with this guy. What's name? Mr. Wolf. I I see that fag over there. What a fucking fag! Asking for a team. Asking for a team in a fucking sandbox server. Straight kill yourself, mate. I was I was gonna try and troll him, but like he 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 was not having it. Anyway, guys, that's it for me. I'm out.